I'm meteorologist Caitlin McGrath brought our WUSA 9 weather classroom and Eco 9 to Pyle Middle School in Montgomery County this afternoon. I know you love to do this, Caitlin. How'd it go? It was so sweet, Leslie. We met with the sixth graders at Pyle today and only half of them. This is just half of them. There's 250 students there. We're meeting with the other half tomorrow. We started the day off with a nice presentation about weather and how we forecast and they had some great questions. They've been studying weather for a couple months now and then of course we got to go outside and check out Eco 9. Everyone's favorite part of the day, of course, because it is just packed with so much cool technology and really does promote environmental conservation and how we can better serve the environment. Environment. And Leslie, I was so impressed with how smart some of these kids are. What I like most about studying the weather is basically figuring out how it affects people, people mainly, and how we can learn from past disasters. And what would you say your favorite type of weather is and why? I would personally say stormy weather since you don't know what's going to happen. Uh, that was Jack. Yeah, do you need someone like a little younger person Ooh, to help with the pretty, weather department? Right? He dressed the part. He <laughs> talked the part. He was so fantastic. And so were all of his classmates. We're so excited to be back out there tomorrow. Of course, though, I did say it's going to be colder. So bundle up a little bit more for those <laughs> visits out to Eco 9. Again, we're heading to Pio Middle School. That's in Bethesda. If you would like us to visit your classroom, just get out your uh, phone and check it out in the app and website. We have a form submission there. You know what I love? Every time you all go out to these classrooms, it is clear that the kids understand that this world is the world they're inhabiting mm -hmm. and they have to do their part to fix some of the stuff that we didn't quite get right and they they're so on it and it's really cool that that is a part in. of their education as yeah. well and they are so forward thinking about how we can best serve the environment yeah. let's hope so because i'm still pulling stuff out of my recycle out of trash <laughs> my children, and they're in their 20s so let's hope they recycle everything i like it okay.